I got steam heat. I got. I'm Bon Bon. I'm Coco. And we are sharing our secrets of theater in the community. Uh, speaking of theater, if you know what song we were singing in that opening credit, hashtag name that musical. You can find us on Twitter at DLWithBK. Can you name it? I don't know. All right. Hey, we're talking about uh, our names. Yes, today. our names. A yes. lot of people have questions about how we came up with our names. Bon Bon and Coco. Obviously, yes. our names are not Bon Bon and Coco. And if you haven't seen already on our little table here, we've had, oh, to the side. <laughs> yeah, you can't read it like this, I'm sure. Uh, that we have different names. Yeah. So she's Siobhan. I'm Siobhan. And I'm Jillian. Those are our real names. We don't mind telling you that. But we do have nicknames. Um, my... Siobhan, by the way, is spelled the Irish Gaelic way, and we've talked about that if you can find anything with my name on it, keychains or anything in the store, send it to us. That you need to send it to us. You can find the address it tagged in this video. Yeah. Yeah, you can find the address. But I would love for you guys to find my name on stuff. It's, it's very hard. hard Mine's to not find. too hard. But I've, been, I've been having trouble finding it recently. Like nobody you? has anything with Jillian. Not even Jill, which I don't go by, so don't send me something. Ugh, gross. But like every there's like Julia and Julian, which is a boy's name. But that's, no Jillian, it's weird. That's crazy. Yeah. Anyway, about our nicknames. Yeah, Bon Bon. I got the nickname like in school. They there was a girl that I knew, a friend of mine, she had said uh, my my last my the last part of my name Siobhan. It's spelled with a B, but it goes with a V in the Irish way. That it sounded like Siobhan when people would say it to me, and so they started calling me Bon Bon, and so that name stuck. And my name Coco. Uh, my last name, as you've seen in prior credits, is Melco. And at we go frequently to karaoke. What? Wait, a what? For singers? <laughs> what? No. Uh, and we use stage names, karaoke names. Yes. Uh, so she's always used Bon Bon, bon, as a bon. karaoke name. And the first time I went with them, uh, way back in the day, <laughs> so long ago, they were like, "Well, you can't use your real name. You've got to have a nickname." So we we're like, "Well, what the heck am I gonna do?" So I was like, "Okay, well, a lot of people call me Melco. I could go by my last name. Uh, no, that's boring." And then I was like. Wait, what? Wait, Coco. we got it. Coco! Because it's kind of like Bon Bon. bon. So we, we... Bon Bon and Coco. Yeah, it works. That's how it happened. And now we have a show. Da -na 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 -na. Hey! Yeah. We're going to talk a little bit about uh, the theater yep. and some more. <laughs> again. <laughs> again, we're going to do it again. And we have something spooky to Ooh. talk about. Ooh. There is a light that the stage managers are required to put out on the stage when locking up and the show is over and everything is dark and it gets put, it's like a lamp, but it's on wheels and it's, there's a giant extension cord and it gets put out there and it gets clicked on. Do you know what that's called? I do. Do you know what that's called? They won't respond. I know. <laughs> I felt like it was Dora the Explorer for a minute there. <laughs> Slight for no swiping. Okay, anyway. It's called the ghost light. Yes, the ghost and light. Traditionally, the ghost light is set out because in the theater, you know, it costs a lot of money to take, keep the lights on and run the theater. Mm -hmm. So they put it out there so that, A, it's a safety precaution. Yep. So that if anybody comes in in the dark, because, you know, even if you come in during the daytime and you shut the door, it's still pitch black in a the theater. Mm -hmm. So you come in and you could fall off the edge of the stage into the orchestra pit or down some stairs or you could really seriously injure yourself. Yep. But superstition, what? Wise, because you know us theater people are very superstitious. Mm -hmm. um, it was started to be believed that the ghost light was put out for the ghosts of the theater, so that if they ever wanted the opportunity to perform in their expired life <laughs> as ghosts, as ghosts, they, they would be able light. to find their way to the stage, and they would have a light to be able to to entertain, and, like moths and it, to a flame. There's also. Um, so that it keeps the bad spirits away or whatever, what have you. It's just, it's lore and superstition, but it's... It's safety. It's safety. <laughs> Pretty much. The ghost light. Speaking of ghosts... What? I That's, think... I think we have some ghosts here. <laughs> I, I don't think they're actually ghosts, though. Wait, what? Pah! <laughs> Here's our ghosts of the day. Say hello to Begam and Brumby. Begam and Brumby. We have a new segment that we would like to call Good Idea, Bad Idea with Begam and Brumby. I feel kind of like the odd man out here. I'm the only one with a K name. You are. Oh. That's okay. We can fix that if you really want. Say hello, guys. <laughs> Hi. 
<laughs> so uh, they came to us with a good idea, bad idea, and we thought that it would be funny if we could film this um, on our show. So what they're going to do today, yes. uh, they are going to try out some ghost pepper fries. And as we all know, ghost peppers, they're the hottest pepper in the world. I can neither confirm it. So, like, either. you can neither confirm it. It's a good chance that they're the hottest peppers in the world. I think world. It's, they're supposed to be like a hundred times hotter than a habanero or yeah, something they're like that. They're, I think they're that's hot. hot. That's yeah. spicy. Keep in mind that's this is hot. Wendy's. Wendy's. Oh, these are yeah, Wendy's ghost Wendy's. pepper fries, so we don't know if they're actually going to kill anybody. Thank you, Wendy's. Yes, it's it was a fast food. Thank you for your sponsorship It's like some on our green bell peppers in here too or something. Okay, yes. we don't really I'm know. Okay, really so sure what are we going to do? Things. On the count of three, we're going to do some uh, good idea, bad idea, and Brompy and Big Yams are going to dig in. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three. And we're going to gauge their reaction and tell you if we think it's a good idea. It's like congealed. Okay, I'm getting a big spoonful. Nothing yet. It's like Wait. not hot at all. Little bit maybe maybe little you need bit. to get those green... green things. Try, little, try little, another bite. Just try a little, little, little bit of something. I'm not, yeah. I'm not really get impressed. More. <laughs> I was, I was I'm going to get a lot. Here, was, we're going to get like a big, a big... I'm getting a big scoop full here. That sounds like a plan. That's like pure sauce yeah, right there. Here we go. All right. Is it in the sauce? Pure sauce. I'm guessing it's in oh, the sauce. I'm throwing my beer. It's okay, wait. I'm starting to feel a little something. Get a little heat? A little something, yeah. It's after heat. It's after... Okay, it's after It's like a post. So on on a rating from good to bad, is it a good or a bad idea? Uh, these are delicious. They're really I like good. Them. Yeah, they're really good. Good idea. All right. Well, yeah, if you guys have any, like these. if you guys have any suggestions for future good idea bad ideas, hashtag us. Good idea bad idea. And hashtag whether or not you thought that was a good idea or a bad idea. At DL with BK. Now we're speaking ready. of hashtags, just they're just oh, 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 wait. Oh, oh, we're getting oh, some reactions now. We got some tears going. Maybe it's turning to do All a right, so idea. we are going to do our random hashtag to end our segment here. Um, and Brumby and Began, they're going to give us each a word. We're going to combine those and make that our random hashtag of the day. Yep, I'm ready. So Began, what's your word? Jalapeno. Hal jalapeno. Oh, and Brumby, what's your Let's word? Let's do goat. Jalapeno goat. goat. Wait, jalapeno. Is that how you spell it? Yeah. Yeah. Goat. Jalapeno goat. All right, and we're going yeah, to react geez. to this random hashtag. This Jalapeno cheese. goat. <laughs> Hold on, Twitter, Twitter's being weird. Thanks a lot, Twitter. Maybe there isn't anything. Jalapeno There's nothing. Goat. There's nothing. Yeah! Oh, we win! Jalapeno goat. There we beat that win. The random hashtag. Hey, win hashtag. Random hashtag. Because there's ding, no ding, picture. Ding, ding, ding. Yeah. Bye. 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 <laughs>